Alright, okay, we should be all set. That might be too loud. We'll see. Let's play a little bit of Shardlight, a little bit of Lisa, and then we'll be done. So, let's do that. If you weren't here earlier, we played some uh, America... America-themed smartphone games, and I did some Oblivion. And those are already uploaded to YouTube, so they're probably processing right now. So let's, uh... Let's get back to Shardlight now. Um... So we're we're in this tower that we just we just climbed up here. We don't know what the heck's up here. We got a baseball bat. We got a torn page. It Was... looks like a giant raven. Seeing that thing gliding around the sky would definitely be intimidating. I've watched a little bit of SGDQ so far. I haven't really been super into it this year, but yeah, it's been it's been all right. I wonder if there was once a raven in there. Probably. Reminds me of the one in the Rebel Hideout. Yeah. What is what the heck's up here? Messy. Someone should really clean this place up. Okay. What's this? I had something like this when I was a kid. A jar of dirt where bugs lived. I had a jar of dirt where bugs lived. What the hell is all this stuff? Ugh. Looks like it's got fungus growing out of it. I thought it looked like a plant. But all right. What type of computer is this? I guess this is the Reaper's base of operations. The Reaper? Uh-oh. Just as I suspected. Empty. God damn it. What the hell is... Can I, can I examine the workbench? Ah! Oh, ah! Oh, Aha! Uh -huh. Just what I thought. They're mechanical. Ha-ha! He is the problem. Weird. I wonder what these are for. They're for drugs, you idiot. He, d he, eats, he eats them. Full of lots of unmarked bottles. I wonder what they're for. Smash it with the bat. Full of... Hmm. Uh -huh. Anatomy, infectious diseases, biology. Quite a collection. Okay, alright. That's fair. What about, uh... Anatomy... These look like security monitors. What are they doing here? The crow's eyes are obviously cameras, and he can look at them through here, Amy. Uh, these look like... Oh, all right, let's get out of here. <gasps> what? The heck is this guy? What is this? Is this guy a, a dang wizard? Ah, uh, Amy Willard. You found me. I was hoping you would. You're the dang doctor from the clinic. I realize you probably have many questions. I can give you all the answers you need. But first, allow me to make myself more presentable. I know who you are. So you are human. Yes. I'm sorry to disappoint you if you were expecting more. I don't know what I was expecting, to be honest. You gonna stop playing League and talk to me? So you're the doctor? You told me you were a doctor. Yes, Dr. Edwin Aquino, at your service. I was once the leader of the Green Lung Vaccine... Wait, maybe he's not the doctor we knew earlier. After learning about their vaccine distribution, or lack thereof, that quickly changed. Hang on. You knew about the vaccine hoarding? Why didn't you tell anyone? That would have started violent riots. It's not fair to begin a civil war when it would end without a cure for the illness. I wanted to say something. It hurt not to, but the time wasn't right. You didn't think the people deserve to know? They do, and they will. But not while we only have a vaccine and not a cure. With a permanent cure, the aristocracy's hoarding becomes irrelevant. And the focus will be on eradicating the disease. I... I guess that makes sense. Oh. So what's with all the robots? Why the mechanical ravens? What do they do? Rather clever little inventions, wouldn't you say? They have video transmitters in their I eyes knew it. and audio I knew transmitters it. in their beaks. I use them as scouts, since I can control them remotely. Did you make them? No, but someone else did. A long time ago. In any case, they've served me quite well. At least, the ones that haven't broken. I have very few left, which is going to be a problem at some point. Just build some new ones, you idiot. Why are you watching me, huh? 
You've been following me with your birds. Why am I of such interest to you? You did a lottery job for the Ministry of Energy. That's right. What of it? You've got the disease. You're fighting to survive. You're clever and resourceful. Exactly what I need. Exactly what do you need? After I left the Ministry of Medicine, I began my attempts at developing a permanent cure for green lung. Oh. It was a long process, which took over 10 years. But just last month, I had a breakthrough and was able to make this. Is that? Yes. This is the cure for green lung. Give me that, you dang reaper. Let me it, gozzle that hard, down. I need to be certain. Aside from that, I don't have the information necessary to mass produce the cure, though I suspect Tiberius keeps it somewhere in the Ministry of Energy. So what is it you need from me? We're both fugitives, Amy. I can't put myself at risk by going to the places I need to. If I'm killed or captured, my research will have all been... You can fly! Nothing. Just you fly away! You can take care of yourself. I saw how you handled things at Rockwall Prison and Willowdale Plaza. You helped me out both of those times. I merely provided some assistance. Your survival was your own doing. Now I realize it's a bit much to ask, but your help would be incredibly valuable. Not just to me, but to the future of humanity. It's not really much to ask. I owe you my life, after all. Thank you, Amy. I appreciate it. The main thing I need is to find out where Tiberius is keeping my research on mass production. At some point, I'll also need a subject to test the cure on, so I can be absolutely sure Yo, yo, sure sign me up for that shit. Do you have any questions? Yo, sign me up for that shit. Uh, yo, first of all, can you give me that dang green liquid? I want to slurp that down. I need that. That's a green lung. <coughs> Why do you dress like that? Intimidation, mainly. The work I do is not exactly looked upon favorably by You the mean government. flying? So I had to come up with a way to make sure I was left Are you going to talk about how you can the grow wings? Is just to make sure anyone who might happen to see me is scared off. So it's a cut, so but you can fly, though. you and decided to become him yourself? No, I'm the one who started them. Creating the image of death personified seemed a natural deterrent for anyone who might get too close. Thankfully... The rumor seemed to have spread rather quickly over the years. You aren't kidding. There's a whole cult dedicated to worshipping you. Ah, uh, yes. I know of them. An extreme example, but I can't deny it helps my work. You can fly, though. Could I see your wings? About your subject, can I try the cure? I'd like to, but it's far too risky. You are one of my greatest assets right now. If this proves to have any adverse side effects, I'll be without your help. Once I can mass produce this, I won't have to be so careful. Listen, I'm gonna die anyway, so just... I got an achievement for that called Selfless. How can we find the mass production information? Ideally, I could use my ravens to go in and locate it, but I only have three working ones left. And as you're well aware, Tiberius's tower is huge. It would take way too long for only three ravens to scan the entire place without being detected. Could I take a look at one of them? Of course. Yeah, let me take a look at this. Who did you say made these? A uh, friend in the Ministry of Knowledge, but that was ages ago. I know very little about their design. Yo, I can fix this. It isn't too complex, actually. I can fix them for you, no problem. You can? Sure. See this bit here? That's the servo, the part that controls the wings. It's worn out, so I just need to replace it with a new one. Are those common? Would we be able to find one or more in the city? Well, I learned about them from working on toy airplanes that my friend had when we were kids. If we could find some, we'd be in business. Okay. Okay. I wonder. Where'd you send him? Yes. Excellent. As I suspected, there's a hobby shop which has remained mostly intact further in the city. And I can see that they have several model airplanes. Great. I'll go get them and fix your ravens in no time. Yes, but the store is located in the quarantine zone. Uh-oh. So, I have nothing to worry about. I'm already infected. You contracting green lung isn't my concern. It's how you're going to get back out. The quarantine zone is designed to keep people from escaping. If I can find a way in, I'll just have to find a way out, won't I? Fine. While you're there, see if you can bring someone back with you. Someone who has been quarantined will make an ideal subject to test the cure on. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Good. All right. Take this then. Give me, give me something. What is this? What is it? A two-way communicator. They used to call them walkie-talkies. We can use them to stay connected while you're in there. 
This is Andy. Colin Reaver, Ulrich. Could you please show me uh, your wings, please? Ulrich. I want to see you grow some wings out of your back. Can you tell me anything about Tiberius? Quite a bit. I've known him for a very long time. Since before the bombs, in fact. Was there anything specific you wanted to know? Oh god, this is a lot. Was he always so evil? I wouldn't call him that. Manipulative, yes. Ruthless, undoubtedly. But not evil. He suffered immense trauma on the day the bombs fell. Everyone did. Not all of us had the wealth to recover so easily. Tiberius lost both his a lot of talk and the unborn here. child that day. Wealth or not, that hits a man hard. It left him quite mentally unstable. Uh oh, I bet his, his baby boy is in that is in that that glass. In trying to cope with his loss, in a way, I felt pity for him, perhaps too much. What do you mean by that? Nothing. Never mind. Okay. Uh, what did he do before the bombs dropped? What was Tiberius like? He was the director of the Ministry of Energy, of course. Back then, he wasn't calling himself Tiberius. He was just Julian. After Julian. Society, his love right. for history. I don't... Why does he wear that awful mask? Anonymity. He felt government leaders are more respected as an institution rather than a... I can't deny that this approach... All right, okay. I don't really care That's why all. he has a suit here. To be honest, let's go. I'll just get to it then. Good luck, hey. By the way, that doorway back there will allow you to get up and down the tower much easier than climbing. Good. Good. All right. I can see why people. Please don't touch that. Please don't touch that. Please don't touch that. I can see. Please don't touch that. Please don't. Please. I don't need them. Please don't. Please don't touch that. Hmm. I don't know the first thing about. Oh, it's a glider. I probably just. He's a dang glider. What an interesting contraption. I wonder. Take it. We could fly around. He doesn't have dang wings. He's not a mutant. He just carries. He's just Batman. He has technology. Please don't touch that. Please. Don't touch that. Just as I. Please. All right, let's go. Get out of here. Hmm. We're going in. We're going into the quarantine zone. Uh oh. Quarantine zone. For a lot of people, this is one of the last signs they ever get to read. Uh oh. Excuse me. Huh? What do you want? A woman. What are you doing? What is it you're doing out here? Transporting people into the quarantine zone. What does it look like? Aren't you worried about getting infected? Well, considering this is a lottery job, not really. Wait, you just put them on that little that little pallet and you you push them? That's all they that's all you do? I need to go. I need to get inside the quarantine zone. Huh. You know, I think that's the first time I've ever heard anyone say that. Why on earth would you want to go into the quarantine zone? There's nothing in there except the sick and dying. Uh, I have green lung. I've got green lung. Is that so? You look pretty healthy to me. That may be, but I can assure you I've got it. Look, my orders are to take people in who are at the terminal phase, and you clearly aren't. So unless you can prove otherwise, my hands are tied. <coughs> Why are you trying to get in there anyway? If I was you, I would avoid telling anyone I was sick. I'm I sick. My uh. I'm sure you do. Keep up the good work. Thanks. Reaper, we got a problem. Uh, hello? Can you hear me? Yes, loud and clear. Reaper, we got a problem. There's a lady she's not letting me in. Over. Could you please help me prove that I'm dying? I need proof that I'm dying. A rather odd request. Yes, but if I'm going to get into the quarantine zone, I need the gatekeeper to think I'm sick enough. I may have a plan. I just hope you aren't faint of heart. Trust me, I'm not. Good. Go out and see if you can find someone who has recently died of green lung. Then use your communicator to let me know. Uh oh. I should be able to help you further from there. Okay, but how will I be able to tell if they died of green lung? Look for green sputum around the body and 
pustules around the wrists. Oh. Okay. Over and out. I know where we can find that. Uh, there was, I think there was one over here, right? Like a dang body somewhere down in here. Or it was, it was in one of these caves. In one of these caves, there was some dang pustules. No, not you. Can I get by? I need to find some sputum. I don't need... Nope. <gasps> to find some dang sputum. Not there. Hmm. No. 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 Wallies. Wallies. This guy. He's dead. No sputum or pustule. Damn it. No sputum. If I had a nickel for every time I walked up to a guy looking for sputum and I didn't find nothing. Maybe, uh, this one. Oh, he's got the, look at this. Look at the, the pustules. The sputum. Looks like he's got pustules on his wrist. Mm -hmm. And there's a small puddle of green goo. On the yeah, I know, sp I know sputum when I see it. Was definitely a victim of green lung. All right, Reaper. <coughs> I'm in position. Uh, hello? Send the drones. Can you hear me? Yes, loud and clear. Damn, these things have range, dude. I found our patient. Excellent. Where is the body located? In Sector 67, right near that painting. I'll meet you there shortly. Is he gonna come swoosing down? Whoa, okay, alright. Poor soul. Hopefully this sight will soon be a thing of the past. Step over there if you would, Amy. I need room to work. What do you mean, room to work? What are you gonna do to him? Oh. What are you doing? You took his dang arm? Here, take this. A severed arm? Yes. Notice the pustules around the wrist. Those are the telltale signs of the terminal phase of green lung. Okay. With some trickery on your part. You should be able to use this to get into the... Oh, you got... I gotta do the thing where you... <sighs> okay. Put your Thanks. own arm inside your shirt and then put that one in your sleeve. Look. Like this. Like this, look. See, it looks like you have another arm. That's what we gotta do. Go, go, go back there. Get out of here. All right, watch this. You ready? You ready for some clever trickery? Watch this shit. Watch this shit. I can make it seem like this is my arm. But if she sees the hand in its current condition, she'll know something's up. Huh. Okay. Let's cut this. I'm not sure. Okay. This is my way of communicating directly with the re- Um. I don't see- I can make it seem- Uh-oh. Wait a minute. We ran into a problem. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. The hand uh is partly decomposed. And there I can't believe I'm carrying this around with me. Well then what am I supposed to do? I'm not sure. Gotta make it more fleshy. Well how am I supposed to do that? Gotta paint it. This so this whole thing is a big trick. Jump off the bridge. Way too dangerous to cross. I tried to hit it with the baseball bat, it doesn't work. Um Listen, you gave me this dang arm and then you didn't tell me how to use it. I don't think he'd be interested. Just as I... Hmm. Just as I... Why not just shoot her? This is another good question. Amy clearly has no problem shooting people. She's done it several times. Pop's farm. Oh, hey, hey guys. Back. Thank goodness. I guess we're starting to get a little boring. A Amy, what's what's that in your bag? Oh, it's it's just it's nothing. Amy, that looks like a person's arm. Why are you carrying that with you? I'm not gonna. Can you please go outside if you're gonna be carrying an infected green lung arm in the house, please? It hasn't been used in. 
you want this? I don't think. I don't. I think he would. That's right. Take a load off. Uh. So I'm being hunted by the aristocracy. They've eased off a bit, but they were really cracking down a couple of weeks ago. I've had to avoid the market district for a while, just because I was sick of being harassed every day. I think they got tired and mostly gave up after a while. You've got yourself some pretty loyal friends. Thank you. Okay. I really come back. Please be. I could just fucking beat her over the head with it. With, I'll see you guys. With, Take care. With the with the arm. Hmm. Do you guys want this? Hey, hey, little girl. You ever see a, a severed arm? I don't think she'd be interested in that. You don't know that. She could. I, I, there's gotta be just... There's gotta be something easy I can do. Let me just talk to her again. Excuse me. Huh? What do you keep up the good... Thanks. Oh. Excuse me. Huh? Keep up... Thanks. Hmm. This is my way of... Uh, hello? Can you hear me? Yes. Everything going okay with you? Yes. How are you faring? Slowly. Okay. Over and out. I really, I don't know, I don't know. Find a glove. Oh, that that could work. I, I wouldn't disguise the whole arm, but yeah, I, I could see that working. Where would there be a glove? Hmm. Perry! Perry, uh... I got the blood lust. Ah. Maybe down in the... There was like a clothing store, right? Let's try that. Oh, shit. Well, there's a prosthetic arm. Um. Creepy. Those are so oh, nice gloves. You're right. Well Look at that. Take the gloves. This will help. Just can you imagine her like struggling to force the glove onto this fucking stiff corpse hand and she's like breaking off thumbs by accident? Alright, let's see. Alright. I'm just gonna play a little trick. Just a little joke. Excuse me. Yeah? What is it? Take a look at this. Oh, jeez. You were kidding. We have to get you inside. Climb up on the card here and let's get a move on. Wow. What a shithole. This place. Well, well. Fresh meat. Uh-oh. I beg your pardon? Welcome to the quarantine zone, honey. Now shut up. Boys. What do you mean, boys? What are you- So, this is how things are going to work, okay? My guys are going to search you and take anything we like. Once we do that, you don't follow us or ever talk to us again. Curl up wherever you want and wait until you do. Okay, but you're anything gonna die are... too. Yeah, a crossbow, radio, baseball bat, a piece of metal, and a severed arm? Huh. It's always the clean ones that are the freaks. Let her keep her little toy. Take the rest. Let go of me! Enjoy your stay while you can. Wow, what a bunch of dicks. They let me keep the dang arm, though, so joke's on them. No. No. Ugh, that smell. No. It's sealed up. No. I am not touching those. No. Uh oh. Oh god. Wow, the quarantine zone sure is a, a stand up place. Look at all these happy fellas. You got little Billy in the corner, Charlie hanging from the rope on a swing, and old Pops taking a nap in the back. There isn't much left of this person to search. I'm not going to touch him. It's disrespectful. You don't want to give him a hand? I don't... I don't see how I... 
I'll let them rest in peace. Yeah, see, you let Pops rest. He's sleepy. Check the cash register. Not surprisingly, it's empty. Hmm. Great. Twelve boxes still sealed. These servos will work perfectly. All right. We got this. Not you two. Oh no. Gordon, what happened to you? I didn't give my materials to the rebels. Instead, I took the aristocrats up on their deal for food vouchers. When I got sick, they threw me in here without a second thought. I thought I'd be taken care of. I should have at least tried helping Dan talk. Maybe we wouldn't be here right now. Maybe my daughter wouldn't be out there alone. Uh oh. It's okay, Gordon. I'm working to try to get a permanent cure for everyone. A permanent cure? That can't be possible. It is. I've seen it. But even if that was true, we're stuck here. There's no way out. I'll find a way. I swear. Well, that's a word of warning. Stay away from the old supermarket. This lady named Rita hangs out there, and she's bad news. Thanks for the heads up, but I've already met her. Just don't go looking for trouble if you can help it. Okay, alright, that's fine. Gordon, uh, have you ever seen this? I don't think he'd be interested in it that. Could be. Could be. Never know. Last one to die. Please turn off the light. He haven't got anything of value on him that I can see. Oh, well, look at all the decorations. These guys were all excited for Halloween and everything. They put up the skeletons. I'd rather not. It looks like this was painted on with blood. Rita Repulsa, more like. I haven't got time to scavenge for parts now. To ground zero. Okay. Foodorama. Looks like this was a food store once. Can't imagine there's a Let's check. Rita! Hey, didn't I tell you not to follow me? Turn around nice and slow and start walking. I want to kill this lady. I need to escape from here. Do you know a way out? Escape? Huh. The only way out of here is through the dead disposal chute. You'll get your chance to escape through there next month. Just be sure you're dead by then. You done asking stupid questions now? Get your ass out of here. Wow, what a massive bitch. Okay, well, we're gonna go to the dead disposal chute because guess what? We're gonna sneak down that chute even though we're not dead. It's but even, we're gonna go down there and then I know Denny's gonna tell someone. He's gonna be like, They're, they weren't dead. He always does this. He's, empty. He's a big, big ass tattletale. It's probably best to keep my distance. They're empty. They're empty. They're empty. You didn't even look. Blast They're zone. Empty. I wish I could just block it out with my hands. Oh, well, you got another one. I don't that. see. Okay. There's nothing out there but level buildings and more dead bodies. Okay. All right. Well, where's this? Where's the shoot? I'll let the. We need a test subject. Well, we're gonna use Gus. Gus will be a test subject. He's got a daughter. All right. Let's go see if Gus will be our test subject. That was probably an advertisement once. What does that say? Looks like a whale man. That looks like a whale person. Gus, listen. I need you to come with me. Hey, Gordon? I mean, Gordon. Yeah. Uh. What's the deal with that Rita lady? I haven't dealt with her too much, but she seems like a bully. Didn't give me too much trouble when I came in, but then... I didn't have much of value on me. Why would she take people's things? It's not like she can take them with her. Who knows? Maybe she's a hoarder. When did they put you in here? I don't know. I haven't been counting. Seems like forever. It wasn't too long after they put up those posters of you in the market. What did you do anyway? It's a long story, and now isn't the time. Any ideas on how to escape this place? Escape? From here? Come on, Amy. The quarantine zone is made to keep people in. Nobody's escaped before. Denby told me he'd done it. Amy, Denby told me he sewed his hoodie using Tiberius' wig hair. I know he's your friend, but I wouldn't put too much stock in his stories. He was well, my friend. I'm not that easily. I'm not dying in here. You don't really have much of a choice, I'm afraid. He looked like a bully, and I hate bullies. I think I know how to get us out of here. What are you talking about? The dead disposal chute. If we can open it, we can escape that way. That chute leads down to the incinerator. 
We'd die before we escape. We might as well just hang ourselves. At least it won't be as painful. Hear me out. Rita said that they wouldn't be disposing of bodies until next month. Tiberius is not the wasteful type. I doubt he'd allow for the incinerator to be on if it wasn't being used. I don't know. This still sounds risky. It is. But if we can help each other out and manage to escape, you'll be able to see Susan again. If not for me, at least try this for your daughter. Okay. Lead on. All right. Think you can get it open? No good. It's sealed tight. What about that button up there? Of course. I saw them pushing bodies down the chute when I first got here. They pressed that button before opening the door. It's pretty high up there, though. Even if I gave you a boost, I don't think you could reach it. No, well, we could try. Nothing around we could use to stand on. I think this means I'm going to need to get my crossbow back. Or use me. the arm. Need me to help you deal. Listen. With it? No, I can settle this on my own. There's no way that standing up on him with the arm wouldn't be able to reach it. My throwing arm isn't good enough to reach. No, the you stand on Gordon and then you use the arm. I don't think. Come on, Amy. We're wasting time. Oh, that's bull. I hate when there's like a solution. You could easily do that. Dead disposal. Oh. It's. All right, well, I guess we gotta go get our crossbow back. Shmata. Listen, eight, uh, what's your name? Rita? She's gone. Huh, where did she go? I hope she's dead. She got crushed under a, a thing, didn't she? Oh, she's having a baby. What's going on in here? What? How did you? Rita, I saw. Oh shit! What the hell is wrong with you, Freddy? You were supposed to make sure nobody came in. I'm sorry. I was. I don't want excuses. Just get her out of here. Ah! <gasps> Hang on. Who is this? Nobody. You need to worry about Freddy. Get her out of here. Relax. I'll take care of it. Don't get our sis even more upset. Don't she get our sis. She's your sister? Freddy! Go ahead, try and touch me. See how that goes for you. I'll leave you alone as soon as you give me back my crossbow. No, my sister and her baby need protecting. All this stuff? Have you been stealing it to help your sister? You think anyone else in this rat hole is going to do it? No, it's all up to me. If I can help you with your sister, will you give me back my crossbow? What are you, a doctor or something? No, but I know one, and I've got a direct line to him on that radio you took from me. Really? See for yourself. Hello? Is anyone there? Amy, is that you? No, my name is Rita. I'm here with Amy. She says you're a doctor and that you can help. I am, and I'll do my best. What seems to be the problem? My sister is in labor, and my brothers and I don't know what to do. I see. The first and most important thing you all need to do is relax. I'll guide you through every step of the process, but you'll need to listen. All right, chat. Listen. This is that you're going to learn how to deliver a baby tonight on the stream. Please pay attention. This is very important information. You may need to you to do this at some point in your life. Pay attention, please. Thank you. Uh, okay. Sure. Step one, put Amy on. Hey, Doc. I can't imagine conditions in there are particularly hygienic. They aren't, no. Do you by any chance have access to water? Actually, yes. We're in an abandoned supermarket that's got plenty. Excellent. What about any sort of instruments like scissors or something sharp? Yeah, I've got a few here. Perfect. Amy, I need you to boil the water in order to sterilize the instruments. You'll need a container to keep the water in, and some way to heat it up. Do you think you can manage? I think so, yes. Good. Put Rita back on so I can tell her what to do. Step two, put Rita Here back on. I'm gonna go see about getting that water. Okay. Alright. Thank you, Amy. I'm sorry. It's fine. Steps to delivering a baby. Get some air. Okay. Oh, thanks. You're super helpful, Jeffrey, or whatever the fuck your name was. Listen, okay. Step one. Put Amy on. Step two, put Rita back on. Okay? Rita, can I take this kettle? Whatever helps. Go ahead. I'm not going to bother him. 
He seems to have enough. Do you want a hand? I don't think. All right, I got a plan. We reach up inside of a Judy with this with this arm. You can grab the baby with its f grippers. It's got it sterile. It's got a glove on. It's fine. We get the extra reach. We pull it out. No one gets hurt. No one has to touch any of the juices. We're fine. All right, we gotta find. We gotta boil some water. My crossbow isn't on the shelf. I can't. S you know what'd be great is if we could just take the crossbow and then leave. There's some water. I probably shouldn't drink this, but I'll take a jug. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, oh, shut I up. Got time to go. S all right. Well, now we got. I'll just fill it about halfway. All right. Well then. Uh, where? Uh, uh, Nothing in. Step three, get the water. Where's the, where do I boil this shit? I should probably. She's not in any condition. To... The water needs to be boiled. Well, where do I do that? It's not hot enough. I don't see. My... There was a fire by the entrance? Oh, you're right, there was. Step four, boil the water. No, don't, you don't pour the boiling water on the baby, guys. Where was it? Was it back here? Tents. Exit. Was it back here? There was like a burning back at the beginning. Is the baby gonna have green lung? Cause it's being born of a woman with a green Ugh, lung. This isn't the way I was hoping to do this. Hey, little Sammy, did we ever tell you how you were birthed? First, we boiled water on burning corpses. He haven't. Got, he haven't got anything of. I haven't got. I no, haven't, no. Things don't look good, but. All right, step four, get the boiling water from the corpses. Now we gotta, st step five, sterilize. Rita, here, I got you the boiling water. Great, Ricky, take over here a second. Yeah, Ricky, do it. Hey, thank you for this. I'm sorry about earlier. I'm not normally like that. Don't worry about it. You were desperate. Yeah. Anyway, you kept your end of the deal, so here's your crossbow. You know, you I would have I helped if you just asked. Too. I figure you can use them more than I can. Thanks. Before I go, my friend is working on a permanent cure for green lung. That's why I'm here. Say what? If all goes to plan, we'll have enough of it to cure everyone soon. You won't have to worry about staying here anymore. You're telling me this now? It's not like you were receptive to new information before. Just focus on helping your sister. Once I get back, your family will be safe soon enough. Thank you, Amy. And good luck. Well, we don't get to stay? How are we gonna t deliver the dang baby? Uh, I should probably... I'm not going to bother. What about my radio? What about my radio? <sighs> I don't care. Alright, step six. Just fuck it. Let them do it. Let them do it. Step... Alright, we're gonna go over the steps. Step one, put Amy on. Step two, put Rita back on. Step three, get some water. Step four, boil the water. Step five, sterilize the instruments. Step six, fuck it, let someone else do it. Bringo. Okay, this is the one shot that really counts. You could just pick up the bolt if it doesn't hit. Nice going. It's way too- Did it not work? I've already- I think we're ready. Would you do the honors? Thanks for the help, Gordon. I promise this will be worth it. I believe you. Even if I don't live to see my daughter again. At least I did something at the end. Alright, let's go. Oh, boy. Oh, no. <gasps> Gordon, quick! Grab the sides! Couldn't she- 
Oh shit. Amy, where are you? Hanging off the end of the chute. Stay still, I'm coming. Oh shit. Oh, that was close. I guess I underestimated the Ministry of Energy. That door over there? I think that's the way out of here. You're probably right. Now we just need to figure out how to get over there. All right, we got to swing. We got to swing. You ever see Indiana Jones? Gordon? I need you to swing on this skelling. It's just out of my No. Look. Put out the fire. There isn't nearly enough water in here for that to work. <laughs> just swing. It's just No. Amy, focus. I'm trying. All right, we get this. It's crazy enough that it just might work. Ugh. Right. Here I go. Weeha! I knew it. Are you okay? He's I'm fucked. Fine. Now I just need to figure out a way to get you over here. He's fucked. Just just finish him. I can't just go. Just finish him off. This rope is still in good condition. I just need to untangle it. Then untangle it. Okay. All right. Gordon, I'm going to throw you the rope. And then I'm gonna yank you over Wily e. Coyote style. He might be able to get across with this rope, but just tossing it at him won't work. All right. Right. One bolt on a rope coming up. Okay. Now we shoot. Shoot the shoot. <laughs> Gordon, watch your head. Oh nice. shit! That's not gonna hold. Sure Are you kidding me? This. That's not gonna hold. Whoo! <laughs> That was a close one. You don't fucking say, dude. Jesus Christ. There's no way that would have worked. Hey, it worked. Nice work back there. Thanks. Do you have any idea where we're going? Not yet. But if we're in a subway tunnel, we should be on the right path back outside the quarantine zone. Okay, well. No way. Who's Debris? He looks like a dang pile of rocks. Gordon, why aren't you coming with me? Come on. What is this? It's loose, but way too heavy for me to move on my own. Well, that's why we got Gordon. We got to push together. What do you know? It still works. Too bad it's useless to me. Something tells me it's way too lost cat. Oh. Reward offered. I hate lost cat signs. Guys, lost pet signs destroy my heart. Whenever I see them, they make me so ridiculously sad. There doesn't seem to be Cupcake, no. Gordon? Hmm? Uh, can you move the debris? Gordon, could you help me move that debris? No problem. There you go. Thanks. You could have done that, Amy. I'm. Hmm. There's a rusty metal bar in here. Might be good for something. Nice. Okay. I thought we were gonna crawl through the crawl space. We don't know Cupcake's dead. Maybe Cupcake is the cat that's in the train. Lost cat. Cupcake. Reward offered. Maybe the cat that's in the train is name of Cupcake. Jeez. Come on, let's keep going. Hey. Well, how about that? You know where we are? I do. And it's time I told you something. What? Remember I said I had seen a permanent cure for green lung? There's a doctor waiting at the top of this building. He's got the cure. And he asked me to find someone who's terminal to be a test subject. I volunteered myself. But I still need to help him get his research for mass producing the cure once it's been tested, which is another issue entirely. I'm sorry I didn't mention all this before, but I wanted to be sure we could escape first. I know it's a lot to take in. What would I have to do? I'm not entirely sure. Just drink the goo. The doctor will be able to explain it to you. We don't know what the side effects might be, and there's a chance it might not even work. But we have to try. Do you want to go through with it? Amy. You've given me a second chance. I'll do anything to help cure Green Lung. Great. It's just up these stairs. It's just gonna turn him into a monster. He's gonna turn into a giant, 
Crab. You're back. And I brought a friend. Come on in, Gordon. Is... is that... Dr. Edwin Aquino. Pleasure to meet you. You're... the Reaper? You didn't tell him? I didn't think he'd believe me. Fair enough. Yes, the Reaper is a persona I created in order to do my work in secret. What's really important is that you volunteer to test my green lung cure. I cannot thank you enough, and I'm sure the entire population will feel the same way once they've been cured. So what is it you need me to do? I'll explain everything, but first, there's another matter I need to take care of. You said you were able to get the servos? I've got them right here. Good. How long do you think it will take to repair the birds? Less than an hour. Excellent. I'm going to take our friend into the next room and get him started on the treatment. I'll be back in a while to see how you're doing. Okay, I'll get to work then. Follow me, if you would. He's gonna come back as a crab. He's gonna c Bye, Gordon. See you later, crab, Gordon. I think that should do it. Perfect. We have one raven for each floor of the tower. We should be able to locate my research in no time. Amy, why are they making these sounds? Oh, I programmed in a, a, a bird call. But that makes them so much less stealthy, Amy. Ah! And now we watch. So what about Gordon? Why aren't you saying anything about him? Aha, uh -huh. there. Through that window. Can you see? Yes, a bookcase being guarded. It's on the 36th floor. Now we just have to determine how you're going to get into the tower. Me? That shouldn't be a problem. I know someone who's pretty good at figuring out ways to sneak into government buildings. Then I wish you luck, Amy. I'll be keeping an eye on you with the Ravens. If you need anything... What about I'll Gordon? Be... Oh, and might I suggest leaving that arm with me? It would help my research and, frankly, draw less attention to you. Of course. Here. What about hey, Gordon? Doctor? Yes? Oh, okay, we just can't... we just can't talk. Is Rita's sister all right? She's fine, as is her son. You did well in helping them, Amy. Rita sounded very grateful. Hopefully they'll be able to get out of there soon. Yes, hopefully. The quarantine zone is no place for a child. Step six, have a boy. Or maybe that's step seven. Step seven, have a boy. Can you tell me anything about Tiberius? I can, yes. Okay. That's all. All right, let's go. I'll just... Good luck. I guess Gordon is just gone. All right. Rest in peace, Gordon. We're going in. Except I, I think we need to talk to Danton first. Danton, I got a question for you. Danton? What is it, Amy? I need to get into the tower. I'm breaking into Tiberius's tower. Can you help me? Come again? He's got the research to mass produce a cure for green lung. We have to get it. Are you sure? Are you absolutely sure? I've been working with the doctor who developed it. He used to work for the Ministry of Medicine, but when he found out they were hoarding vaccine, he went rogue. Sounds like a good man. Why haven't I heard of him before? Surely you've heard of the Reaper. He created the disguise to work in secret. This, this is perfect. The opportunity to strike is finally here. Danton, wait. She tells you the Reaper is a doctor and you're just going to spring an attack? We don't have enough men or supplies to do this safely. We could lose everything. If we don't act now, we've already lost everything. How can you say no? We'd thwart Tiberius and pure green lung in one night. Because we can't do it. Danton, this isn't a game. People will die. You think I treat this like a game? It's because of me. Both of you, stop! No wonder this revolution hasn't gone anywhere. What would we need in order to mount an effective assault on the Ministry of Energy? We need to find an access point to sneak in. Going through the front doors would be suicide. Some way of approaching the tower from above or even underground would be ideal. We also need to find a way to lure the guards at the base of the tower outside. Yes, that's perfect. If we distract them, we can ambush them and weaken their defenses. Okay, so a way in and a distraction. I'm on it. Good. We'll begin preparing the troops. Okay, uh... 
What can I use for a distraction, Danton? So we need a distraction. What do you suggest? My thought would be to have a group of people show up. I wasn't I wasn't talking to you, Bruce. Up. Yes, I like that idea, but we can't spare any of ours. We need them for the ambush. If you know a bunch of folks who would be willing to demonstrate in front of the tower, that would certainly be an option. What was your idea of try? Do either of you have an idea on how to find a way into the tower? The more I think about it, it seems like a better idea to get in from underground. I know there used to be a system of tunnels around the center of the city before the bombs. If we could find someone with a working knowledge of those tunnels, we'd be set. All right, well, let's go. For me to, if you need a place to hide. I've been streaming for 54 minutes. And then I also streamed for like three hours earlier today. Uh. Hmm. These guys. These guys will be a distraction. They'll do anything for the Reaper. It's perfect. No, not this way. These guys will do it. Hey, Jess. What is it, Amy? I need you to be a distraction. I was wondering if you and your flock could help me. Of course, Amy. What do you need? I need to get inside the Ministry of Energy. But to do so, I'll need a distraction. Would you be able to provide one? A distraction? Most yes. of you will probably I was die. Thinking if you could stand outside the tower and play music or chant or something. You disappoint me, Amy. I thought you were better than that. I didn't mean to offend you. I just thought... I'm sure you did. In any case, unless the Reaper himself provides guidance on the matter, I won't see my people used as a mere distraction. All right, well... See. Have a good day. May death come to you. All right, well, we got him. We just gotta go, get, we gotta go tell him. He's gotta come make a guest appearance. Hey, kids, it's me, the Reaper. I need you all to go out in front of the Ministry of Medicine. <laughs> The fuck was that voice? I need you to go out in front of the Ministry of Medicine, and I need you to be a distraction. Hey, Doctor. Yes? So says I, the Reaper. Can you come with me to the Cathedral of St. Stephen? What for? The Reaper cultists aren't cooperating, and I think you might be able to talk to Be sure to them. buy lots of crabby patties. <laughs> yes, I think it's about time. They That's what was in my head. Thing. That Fair fucking enough. part, Krusty the Clown. <laughs> Jess, are you busy? We just finished our new Make train. sure to we'll buy busy. lots of Krabby Patties! Right now. Bring the others, it's important. If this is about your request, use us as a distraction. Please, just trust me. You and everyone else here, you need to see what's outside. Fine. Acolytes, Sister Amy has something she wants us all to see. Why not just go in and say the Reapers outside? So what Everybody. Is it supposed to see. Hey kids, it's me, Reapy the Reaper. Make sure to buy lots of green lung cure. It's the Reaper. His worship. He's he's finally here for us. Oh, blessed day. Please, your worship, take me for Please. I'm ready to die. It will be an honor to die at your hands, your worship. Enough! It, it can't be. It can, and it is. I'm very sorry to disappoint, but you've all been worshipping a doctor in disguise. What the, How can that be? Everyone dies when you're near. My name is Dr. Aquino. I developed a cure for Green Lung by studying those who have died from it. This outfit was only intended to scare people away. I had no idea it would have such an effect on all of you. I saw you. You were bent over Wilson's body. He had just died. You took his arm. Yes, I remember you. You stared at me, and I was afraid you would approach. I am sorry for the trickery. I had no idea this would happen. So what do we do now? I was ready to die with you, you imposter! Just kill me! Kill me now! Just Everyone fucking just kill me! Don't you get it? He has a cure for Green Lung. Nobody has to die anymore. Nobody! She speaks the truth. 
All I need to cure everyone are my research notes from Tiberius's tower. We need help sneaking inside. If you can help us distract the guards, we can do it and get what we need. If we distract the guards, we'll probably die there. How can you tell us we have hope to survive by doing the most dangerous Y'all just want to listen. Ten minutes ago, you were praying for death. Let me, let me tell you something. The best course of action would have had him come over and not take off his disguise and just say, I need you all to go make a distraction and if you die it's your time to die and they all been doing like yeah why not die helping your families your town yourselves jess you've led all these people to believe that there's something better after death and that there's a promised land why not help the world we live in become that promised land i i'll do it they One definitely they shouldn't have taken off his mask energy this evening we'll do all we can to keep you safe amy I'll see you once you've gotten my research. Count on it. Thank you all. I'll see you tonight. They definitely should have just played these people. They should have just been like, go to the front of the tower. Oh shit, we're getting close to the end, I think. Why can we still go to the train? Wait a minute. What is... Cupcake? So you're back. Where's Cupcake? Excuse me. What? Do you know if there's underground access to the Ministry of Energy? Of course. One of the subway lines ran right underneath the tower. You're not planning on sneaking in there, are you? I am, actually. What on earth for? It's a long story, but I need to get something from inside, and I can't go through the front door. Huh. Well, I'm not gonna ask any questions, but if you're set on it, give me a second. I'll be right back. You know, ma'am, the cat you have may be very valuable. Just letting you know. There was a reward. Here you go. It's not to scale, but if you follow this map, it should take you to where you want to go. Thanks. I hope you know what you're doing. I'll just be on my way. Alrighty. Where's Cupcake? Cupcake! Miss you, son. There you are. Also, what was the point of fixing this? I still around with this record player isn't. My... I don't think that would. He's sound asleep. Nice to know things are relaxed enough. I can't. What was the point of fixing the record player? I definitely think that's the same cat. That's my head cannon. That way, that cat in the missing poster isn't dead. Jeffrey. Jeffrey! I miss you, son. We're all ready to go, Danton. I think we could probably finish this tonight. It seems like it's wrapping up. Danton? What is it, Amy? The dev told you last time that if the lady would have told you if you hadn't... About the coin if you hadn't fixed it. Oh, okay, then I fucked up. I've got everything we need to assault Tiberius's tower. Are you absolutely sure? Positive. The Reaper cultists will provide the distraction we need, and I've got a map showing how to access the tower from underground. Excellent. We have no time to lose. Bruce, go get Amy those bolts from the weapons cache. She'll need as many as we can spare. I really hope you know what you're doing. This is it, Bruce. Don't mind him, Amy. He doesn't fully understand the importance of this opportunity. You've done well. Soon, the aristocracy will be remembered as nothing more than a bad dream. Here, this should be enough to keep you safe. Thanks. Good. Bruce, you'll lead the ambush team. Amy and I will follow her map and enter the tower from below. Once the distraction is in place, I want you to unleash hell. The aristocracy must feel the sting of our blades. Don't worry. We'll have you covered. Good luck to you. I look forward to celebrating our victory. Likewise. Okay. All right. Here. According to the map, we should be right underneath the tower. Hmm. I can't see any way to get inside. There has to be. I'll have a look around. Right here. Moving all that rubble would take too long. We well, I got this. I don't see... All right, then smash the light. I can... Danger. Do not walk on the tracks. I hardly think that. What about this? I can't re Shoot it. 
Ringo. Nice work. This should be a good way in. What are the odds? We should really ready? pick up that yes. bolt. Head up and see where the trapdoor leads. I'll radio Bruce and make sure everyone is in position. Right. I don't trust this Bruce fella. Rejoice, rejoice, for the Reaper is near. Soon this life will be but a memory, and the spoils of the Promised Land will be everyone's for the taking. Brothers and sisters, join me in adoration of our savior! <laughs> Here now, this is private property. You'll need to take your celebration somewhere else. But, brother, our mission is to spread the word of the Reaper across the land. Be that as it may, you are not allowed to gather here. Please disperse at once. Ah, you are fortunate. You will soon know the Reaper. How I envy you. What are you- Oh, shit. What the- Sounds like some kind of commotion outside. Come on, we'd better check it out. This is getting intense. This is getting intense. Oh, shit, son. Guys, I'm like, this is really cool. Inside the belly of the beast at last. Disgusting. We'll have much to change when we come into power. Right. Enough dawdling. We need to get moving. Lead the way, Amy. All right. We're going. We're going. We gotta kill the. Come on. The elevators are this way. We gotta kill the soothsayer. Time to meet the sweet boy. Wait, what is this area? Oh yeah, we gotta. We're go. getting through that elevator. I suggest you surrender now. Fine, we'll do this the hard way then. <laughs> oh jeez, Danton, he was on his knees. Oh fuck! Thanks for the help. He was a tough one. Don't mention it. Yeesh. There's nothing I can do for him. There's nothing. Fucking hell, Danton. There'll be time for breaking. Dr. Aquino said the research was kept on the 36th floor, so that's our next stop. After you. Jesus, Danton. He was. He gave up. He was done. Fucking madman. Just fine. Just fine? You're not scared or... You just cut that guy's head off, Danton. I've been scared too much of my life, Amy. So has everyone else. It's why we're in this situation. We could die today, you know. Maybe, but my last moments will be spent ridding the world of tyranny. If anything happens, I have this car I'm fixing. Could you make sure my friend Gordon gets it? Of course. In the event of my passing, return my hat to Bruce. Our mother will need to know. Sure. We're about to meet the boy. Wait, maybe Is that not. What you're looking for over there? Yes, but when I saw it at Dr. Aquino's, it was being guarded. Hmm. Something about this doesn't feel right. See what you can find. I'll come. No, no. What's the matter? There's nothing here. Dr. Aquino's notebook is gone. No, that can't be. It can't just have vanished. Tiberius must have taken it somewhere else. We'll find him and we'll make him tell us where it is. Come on, we've just got a few floors left to go. If he was smart, he would have burned it. There's nothing in There's no What if you just I missed can't... it? You really should look a little harder just in case. It's empty. They really should look like on all the shelves. Just in case. I have a more pressing map. All right, let's go. Let's go then. All right, let's keep heading up. Right behind you. We're gonna finally find out who the sweet boy is. Don't worry, Amy. We're almost there. I can't wait to see the look on Tiberius's face when. Uh oh. What's that? Damn! The elevator stopped. They must have realized where we are. We've got to get out of here. We're sitting ducks. I'm gonna try and pry the door open. Maybe we can escape that way. Now go up through the, the roof. There's always a panel on the roof. 
I can't. Do you see the dang movies? Ah, excellent. We can climb up to the next floor and figure out a way to keep going from there. Hup. More guards? Just what is Tiberius afraid of? No matter. Danton, wait! She's gonna cut their heads off. Stand down, wighead scum! This is a surprisingly American game to be playing today, actually. I never really realized that, but there's like like guys in colonial uniforms. I don't want to risk hitting Danton. There has to be a better way of taking Oh, oh I see. Damn, the bolt just bounced off. What? The rope. The rope. <laughs> nice going, Amy. You'd make your father proud. All right, okay. What a mess. I'd better not mess with it. It's empty. All right, let's go. Let's keep going. Okay. Shouldn't be much further now. Are you ready? Just one second. I need to check in with Bruce. Bruce, come in, Bruce. Do you copy? Uh oh. Hmm. There's a lot of dead down there. Hard to tell from up here, but I think they're mostly guards. We need to move. They'll be coming for us. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Out of my way, soothsayer. What? Who are? <gasps> Where is Tiberius? And where is he keeping the green lung research? You. You are Danton. At your service. Finally, someone's someone saying it the way I say it. Where is Tiberius and where is he keeping the research? He. he's up those stairs. He has the research with him. He was planning on using it as a bargaining chip. But please, have mercy. Tiberius is not well. He. believes things are not as they are. What are you talking about? I. took advantage of his weaknesses. I have not been honest with him about my abilities. A fraud psychic. How original. I am not proud of what I have done. Please, I beg of you, spare my life. I promise to atone for my mistakes. But I implore you, be gentle with Tiberius. He doesn't understand the truth. This guy's a real piece of work. What do you think, Amy? Should we spare him? You can atone for your sins. In hell. His lies of a wise. No, please. Come on, we're almost done. <laughs> Do not fret, we aren't in any danger. The rebels will be defeated. Soon things will go back to exactly as they were, and it will be as though none of this ever happened. I love you too, son. Son, I knew it! I knew it was his baby boy! Tiberius, your time is nearly over. Here's the traitor, your oh, majesty! You must be the elusive Danton. And Miss Wellard, you're still alive. No thanks to you. Esteemed guests, how lovely of you to break into my home. What is it you want? We're putting an end to your reign, Tiberius. This all ends right here, right now. <laughs> How cute of you! Do you think you can waltz in here and fix this city's problems simply by killing me? It's a start. Do you really think the aristocracy will end with me? That it cannot function on its own? A government has no strength without its head. I'm taking over. Oh, and how do you intend to do that? By becoming you. What? What? I will wear your mask and clothes. I will become the new Tiberius. What? Then I will bring down the aristocracy from the inside. That's fucked. Don't Absolutely. you don't have to do that. You don't have to be Tiberius, just be Danton. Blood will stain your hands in pursuit of this goal. Less than yours. 
And if you do manage to bring about this change you so desire, how will you handle the plague or outside forces who wish to attack? Green Lung won't be a problem for much longer. We know you've got the research to mass produce a cure. Your old friend, Dr. Arkino, will see to that. He lives as well? Yes, he's the Reaper. <laughs> of course. It makes perfect sense. I think this little charade has gone on long enough. I couldn't agree more. No! What were you- <gasps> My boy, my sweet, wonderful boy, how could you? You detestable hag, do you realize what you've done? Oh, my beautiful boy, my only son. That thing is your son? Hold your tongue or I will feed it to the raven's willard. So that's what the soothsayer meant when he said, oh, God. Do you see, Tiberius? This is the real world. Your family is dead. The city is a mess. Your delusions hurt everyone around you. Amy, this is up to you. Set your sights on his heart. Go ahead, Amy. Finish him off. Put the pathetic creature out of his misery so we can rebuild. Miss Willard. You cannot let her be in charge of a new government. She will ruin more than she will build. If you spare me, I will make sure that you and those you hold dear are taken care of. You'll want for nothing. Order must be maintained, but we can make things better. Slowly. Peacefully. Don't listen to any more of his lies, Amy. Only a blood can fix a drought. <laughs> Both. <laughs> Everyone's saying both. <laughs> you want to see all the endings? Is this the end, though? Both of you can say goodbye. In hell! <laughs> this will change nothing. Good work, Amy. You made the right- Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Saving our country. I'm sorry it had to end this way. Jesus! Both of you. She died in his son. He just fell in the sun. So. So. I got your research. Indeed. And so much more. That was quite the impressive display. So what happens now? At the very least, we cure Green Lung. After that, I have no idea. There's still the other aristocrats to deal with. Yes, and the question of who will govern the people. Please stop looking at me like that. I am no leader. Consider what you've done in the past few weeks. How quickly you've risen. The city needs someone like you, Amy. I'll do it, but on one condition. I want you to rule with me. Oh? Sure. You have connections in the other ministries. Help me take Tiberius's place and convince the remaining aristocrats to form a better government. Introduce a bit of uncertainty. Hmm. Are you sure that's what the people will want? The people want their lives back. I think we can deliver that. Interesting. I think it will take a lot of work, but we can definitely build a better future for this city. Which reminds me. What's this? A carburetor and spark plugs. Designed to fit an older model vehicle. They were just laying around. I... I... Thank you. Don't mention it. Now I think we should part ways for the time being. We both have a lot of work to do. I should have the cure ready in a few days. I'd be honored if you were my first patient. It would be my pleasure. Take care of yourself, Amy. Ah! Ah! November 9th. 21 years since the bombs fell. Growing up, I thought my biggest headache would be gas leaks and carburetors. 
Now I worry about national food supplies. Still, it was worth seeing the party in the streets when Greenlung was finally cured. Dr. Aquino is confident our industry will be back in the next five years at this rate. I certainly hope so. Sometimes, I miss the old days, when I could just fix cars and stop for a chat with my friends. But at least now, when I look out over the market, I can see them all smiling back at me. Alright, so we need to see the other endings, I guess. How do I... I, I want to I watch the credits, but I also want to skip the credits the first time, just so... Alright, hold on. fuck is this hold on I got an idea to make this a little more topical okay all right uh, let's uh <laughs> Let's let's look at the other endings. Hold on. People want to see the other endings and so do I. All right. Let me, let me just close the game and restart it. I hope I don't think we saved that that long ago. Blood in the water. Steam is preparing to launch Shard Light. There we go. All right. Let's let's look at the other endings. I'm curious. That fucking performance by Abe Goldfarb was really fucking good, though. When he was lamenting the loss of his baby sweet boy. Alright, go. Alright. Alright, let me just save, like, as, as recent as I can. Okay, just We come up. What? Where you at? What put I up? Just spare him yes. this time. He spent many years advising Tiberius. Very well. Leave now. Thank you. Alright, so he's safe. We saved him. Don't worry. Come on. Alright, can I save now? Ugh, I can't save. Alright. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to watch this. I'll skip the text, but. They said we were half done at the last stream. But that was only like an hour left. Yes. I. No! What were you? My boy. That. Do your. All right. Go ahead. Kill Tiberius. <laughs> this will change nothing. Good work, Amy. You chose well. So what happens now? We've got a lot ahead of us. It won't be easy. I'll dispose of him, then take the Reaper his research so he can get to work on the cure. From there, we'll figure out who is loyal to our cause and who isn't, and cut down those who oppose us. You did a good job here today, Amy. I thank you for your service. But now you're just Not becoming him. Now if you'll excuse me, I have work to do. We'll be in touch. If you don't, if you kill him, you'll be just as bad as him, Danton. You must be Dr. Aquino. Amy told me all about you. And you must be Danton. I have to say I'm surprised to see you in Miss Wellard's place. Is she all right? Oh, she's fine. I just felt it was more suitable to return your research myself. After all, we'll be working together to produce this cure. Looks like it was my job, actually. I only hope there are still people left alive to be cured once all is said and done. More people live, thanks to me, uh, than would ever flourish me, under the actually, thank, thank you. Oh, I don't doubt you'll bring change to the city. I just question your methods. The grass always questions the boulder that rolls quickly down the hill. But soon enough, you'll see how. Oh, much okay, Danton. Yes, goddamn fortune cookie. Nominal fertilizer. 
I'm sure we'll be seeing plenty of it. Maybe so, but in the end, we'll be free of the aristocracy. We'll see what happens. At the very least, Green Lung will be eradicated. Perhaps once the disease is taken care of, you might consider more diplomacy? I'm not unreasonable. Our ultimate goal is a peaceful existence. Then at least we can agree to a better future. I think we should part ways for now. There's lots of work to be done. Good luck to you, Doctor. The Resistance thanks you for your service. And to you. Ah! November 9th. 21 years since the bombs fell. Danton stuck Tiberius's head over the entrance of the ministry. Jesus! Room. People waiting in line for their cures were both amazed and terrified. Her revolution against the other ministries had many recruits who quickly went to their deaths. Sometimes I wonder if all this bloodshed was worth it. I've lost more friends and loved ones in the past year than I can count. But at the same time, they met their ends with pride. They died with dignity. I suppose in this dusty, dying place, that's all you can really ask That wasn't for. good end. That was bad end. Chaos. I just got an achievement called Chaos. Alright, we're gonna find the last end. The last end. Tiberius will find a way to revive his baby fetus sweet son. His sweet boy fetus. And then that baby boy will become the new king. And Green Lung will be cured for all. Okay. Just... Boop. Boop. Come on now. There's no need to get violent. We come on. What? What? You, uh, what uh, 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 What are you... Yes. Leave. But... I think the best ending, I'm guessing the best end is kill them both, which is ridiculous, but okay. Do not. I love you. I love you. Type. Ah. Uh, no. Is. Wait. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Do you really think they are. Uh. Oh, bye. The out. And if you do manage to bring about this change, you still We... Yeah. Ah. Uh. No! Watch where you... My boy. My sweet, wonderful boy. You detestable hag! Do you realize what you've done? This is an amazing performance. That... Oh. Do your... All right. Go ahead and shoot. Don't. Shoot Danton. Let's try it. No, no, this can't be. You've doomed us all. Very good, Miss Willett. Now there is just one last loose end to tie up. I cannot allow you to take those research notes. Allowing them outside the control of the aristocracy is out of the question. Are you planning to develop a permanent cure? Given current events, it would be foolish not to. In any case, I am a man of my word. You will receive a dose of the cure as soon as it is available, as well as provided a new home with access to clean water and food. All this, of course, in exchange for your silence. You are not to tell anyone about what you have discovered. Settling any public unrest is already going to be a difficult task. Understand that violation of this agreement will have swift and dire consequences. Do I make myself clear? Yes. I hope you know what you're doing, Tiberius. More than you know. Please, leave me now. I have much to do. Worst ending. Worst ending. That's worst end. Edwin, you've never looked better. Julian, I must say I'm surprised to see you. Does this mean, Miss Willard? She's quite all right. In fact, I would argue she's never been better. She's decided to take up my offer of working as a government mechanic. I see. As part of the deal, I am to offer amnesty to her friends and loved ones. Your old position at the Ministry of Medicine is available, should you choose to return to it. Not if you continue hoarding vaccine. No, those days are past. I'm afraid that unfortunate attempt at an uprising has made me have a change of heart. Your research will be used to mass produce a cure. 
There are other ways to maintain order. So you want me to work for you again, but you'll produce the cure no matter what? Correct. No. I see. Is that your final word? You've set fire to this country too many times under my watch, Julian. I'm done. There are other cities out there. Other countries. I'll find my place in one of them. Goodbye, Julian. Give my regards to Miss Wellard. Worst end. <laughs> November 9th. 21 years since the bombs fell, and we finally have a cure for Green Lung. People were celebrating in the streets for days. I've never seen such a desperate line with so many tears being shed. But Tiberius wasn't lying. Now food, water, and housing are even harder to come by. Despite this, I still hear whispers about glorious Tiberius, who saved us all from Green Lung. My friends and I are taken care of, but everything has changed. We sit down to dinner together and just stare at the food. We don't know what to do with it, how to feel about it. We eat in silence. We try to forget how we earned our place. At night, I pray Dad is still proud of me and the choices I made. I think you're right, somebody. I think they, they did borrow this. I think they borrowed this credit song from Final Fantasy X, I think. Wasn't that the song that played during the, the love scene between Titus and, uh, and, and, uh, Yuna? I believe that was. That's actually, I, I wonder if they, they got in trouble for that. In all seriousness, though, uh, I liked that game a lot. The, the ending where you shoot them both is clearly best end. It's clearly the best end was, was the first end. Which is weird because you'd think the one where you shoot everybody is the bad end, but... It was a good game. It was a good game. There's my boy Mike Pollock. This is an okay song. I like this. It's alright. I think the Blackwell games I got more attached to as well, but this was still good. It was a very good point and click. So I'll, I'll move on to another Wajidai game at some point soon, but I'll take a little break from them for now. Yeah, we're gonna switch over to Lisa in a couple minutes. Um, I actually was thinking of maybe playing through Cave Story next after this. Because I haven't played Cave Story in a really long time. And I've actually never gotten, like, the good end of Cave Story. And I'd like to do that. That could be fun. But yeah, we're gonna switch over to Baby Lisa after the credits, so... Hamtaro will be soon, Sun Bunny! <sighs> I already did Oblivion today. I did Oblivion for like two hours earlier. If I can get my uh, my PS3 streaming, I'll uh, I'd like to stream JoJo All Star Battle, but I uh, have to figure that out. I'm gonna plan on I'm gonna try and figure out how to do that tomorrow. I like this game. Uh, 
I like this music. But yeah, that was Shardlight. Pretty good game. Pretty good game. I liked it a lot. Some guy. Who the heck is some guy? Who the heck is that? The attendees of Mittens 2015? Who? What is Mittens? Oh, me? Me? Guys, I'm in the credits. Good game. Good game. Okay. All right. So give me a couple minutes and uh and I will uh be switching over to Lisa probably in uh 2 or 3 minutes. So stick around if you want to watch some Lisa. If you don't, uh I'll talk to you later. All right. See you in a couple minutes.